Hi guys, so it's just clicked over to Wednesday. It's 2.33 a.m. and our little baby's fast asleep finally. So because he was screaming and everything, my husband decided to pamper me. So he gave me a back rub and massage with baby oil. We actually ended up using the baby oil which I'd put Jasmine in, which was supposed to induce labour before I went into premature labour with Liam. Well, if you can call it that. Basically, it didn't get used for the purpose, so we used it for my back rub today. And then I had a shower, and I didn't realise that you can um, adjust the shower head. And my husband adjusted it, and it was like jet stream or something on the back of my head, and it actually felt really, really awesome. So I'm definitely doing that from now on. <laughs> and um, he just painted my toenails. He was going to cut them, but I had already cut them before, so I didn't need done. So he painted them red. There you go. And now I'm just enjoying a foot ease foot spa. Now a lot of people think that these foot spas are quite useless, but I actually love them. I love anything to do with massage. And my primary love language is touch. And my husband's is acts of service, I believe. So basically that means that if he wants to please me, he has to do something to do with touch, like a massage or head rub or something like that. And if I want to please him, I have to do an act of service, like the dishes or something. I don't know. So that's what that's about. So I'm just enjoying a nice foot massage because I haven't really had a decent foot pampering for absolutely ages since the time I was in the bath with Liam, which was over a month ago now, I think. So um, in the foot spa, I've got this mum and me calm and soothe bath soak which I believe is supposed to heal um, like vaginal bruising and that sort of stuff but it's actually quite nice for my feet as well because it's supposed to make it all soft and smooth so I'm using that right now it's so lovely, I love massages and anything like that so my husband bought pancake mix for tomorrow morning I'm really really excited, we haven't had pancakes since before Liam was born and um, I've been craving going to the pancake kitchen for absolutely ages now. But hey, like Cole's pancake mix is a lot cheaper. So <laughs> we'll have that. And I bought some ice cream and I even bought an apple pie. It's in the freezer. It was like $2. So it was really good for like a massive apple pie. So I don't know when we'll have that, but that's a nice treat for this week. And also on special, I bought some um, raspberry and white chocolate muffins. So that's another dessert that we could have later on. So I'm really excited because we don't usually have dessert after dinner but I thought this week we'll have a bit of a treat. So my husband's also hinted that for Mother's Day I might get some sort of other pampering like from a day spa or something. He was like oh no more of this scoop on junk I'm gonna get you something really good. So I'm really excited now. I've never been to a day spa so that would be really cool. Alright guys, well I'm going to fully enjoy this food spa, which I can't do talking to you all day, so I'm going to go and thumbs up, subscribe, like it if you are jealous, <laughs> and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!